Hello everyone, welcome. This is Vagrant Essentials Built Portable Environments by Adionix. My name is Ahmed and this is a course introduction. So it's a fast, fast world. Yes, that's true. Technology is evolving at an unbelievable pace. Every day or another, we have a new language that we want to learn. We have a new tool that got freshly developed and we want to have a look at. We have a new service that is available and want to try it out. And as IT professionals, we should be aware of the latest trends in the field. This requires downloading and installing dozens of bundles and packages and building a lot of environments. So are we going to do all that on our personal computers? Of course not. I'm using a virtual machine and that is a good choice. A virtual machine will cut the hardware cost and it's relatively easy to set up, configure and destroy when not needed anymore than traditional physical hardware. However, it takes time and effort to set up. It takes more time to download and install and deploy the necessary packages post the OS and installation of course, even more time is required to configure the installed environment before it can be used to set up for example configuration files to fix any errors and so on and so forth. In addition you will often be working in a team where each developer will be needing a slightly different environment to fit his or her own needs. That's even more machines and more time wasted. So how about using Vagrant? What if I told you that you can download a complete development environment that is an OS prepackaged with the necessary tools, libraries, and services that enables you to start working right off the bat. One of this very same environment can be shared among different users and using of course version control systems like Git, each one can have a customized copy. How about building your own traditional machine like using VirtualBox or VMware and then converting it into a Vagrant machine so that you can enjoy the above features? Well, welcome to Vagrant Essentials Build Portable Environments. So, who you are or what do I expect from you? I assume my audiences are DevOps engineers or people who want to learn more about DevOps tools and methods. Developers of all types. I assume that any developer can benefit from this course. Just anyone who struggles with requiring a lot of environments for building and testing software applications. Of course, this is for system administrators. They, whether they're working on Windows, Linux, Mac, it doesn't matter. If you are continuously tasked with building new environments for developers, this course will save you a lot of time and effort. And of course, this course is aimed at students who need to learn a number of different programming languages and or tools and technologies and need a fast way to get their labs up and running. What you need for this course? Actually, we need a basic understanding of virtualization technologies and a working knowledge of using a provisional like the virtual like VirtualBox or VMware. So if you have created a virtual machine before and used it either on VirtualBox or, or KVM or VMware, if you understand the concept of virtualization and abstraction and how virtual machines are used, you are more than fine. I also consider that you know your way around Linux as we are going to use Ubuntu as our example system. So if you know how to navigate the file system and how to install packages, you are okay. And as a matter of fact, one long lab in this course is using the LAMP stack. LAMP stack is short for Linux, Apache, MySQL, and PHP. This is a very popular buzzword used by PHP developers and web developers in general. So if you've worked with PHP and the LAMP stack, this is a plus, but this is not required to follow along and grasp the concept. I hope you're going to enjoy learning this course as much as I enjoyed teaching it, and I hope to see you in section one.